not available until November. So it's still there. It's still an option. But if she can really get me into one of these houses, you guys, I'm going to give me a house. Like, I'm going to give me a house. Fuck that garden tub. Fuck that island. Like, I'm going to get me a house, you guys. Like, I just need the space. Like, I need the room. <laughs> to another weekly vlog you guys so today is actually monday you guys and do not mind the way i look y'all because i just worked <laughs> some long hours last night into the morning time you guys i got off at 8 a.m so yeah i am like exhausted right now it's actually um like 11 40 11 42 you guys and right now i'm about to take mimi to the doctor because over the weekend mimi did turn seven so now she has her seven year old checkup at the doctor so we're on the way to the doctor you guys so she did not go to school today because she gotta go do that you guys so um yeah y'all so i literally just got like two hours of sleep you guys and i am like so freaking tired y'all i'm 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 exhausted y'all from work so Still as we done over here, you guys. I'm coming back home, baby. I'm jumping my behind in the tub, you guys. I'm going to sleep, y'all. I am just so, 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 so exhausted, you guys, from working. Um. So yeah, y'all. So I just want to pick you guys up, introduce the vlog. Um. Don't really have much planned today because I literally just got off work a few hours ago. So the plan was only to take Mimi to the doctor. I do need to go to the grocery store, you guys. I do need to go make a few groceries. Um, Mimi does need more stuff for her lunch. I need more stuff in the house. I need uh, more water and stuff. So I do need to go to the grocery store. But once I wake up from a nap, you guys, I really wanna go ahead and start packing up the rest of my closet because I have more clothes that's in my closet that needs to be packed up so and i have more clothes in my dresser drawers you guys i really only want to leave out like at least like maybe two weeks worth of clothing that i want to leave out because y'all know i'm about to move in november so i want to go ahead and start packing up shit y'all because when it's time to go baby it's time to go okay and i want everything literally by my front door ready to be moved out you guys so i do need to go ahead and um i want to go ahead and pack up like this would be like the rest of my clothes like i just want to leave out two weeks worth of clothes for me two weeks worth of clothes for mimi and like two covers you guys one sheet for the bed and that's that i want to literally pack up like every piece of clothing towels like i, I want to go ahead and pack up all that stuff yes i have a lot of that stuff already packed up but it's a lot of that stuff still in my closets so i just want to go ahead and get like all of that out um packed up put it by the door you guys um I want to cook something tonight too so that's kind of what i want to do really just be in the house today hey y'all welcome back to the vlog so i know i recorded like <laughs> two maybe three days ago you guys but i ended up getting a phone call so i had to like put y'all down for a little bit but anyway so i'm back it's a new day today is actually wednesday and right now we are at a eye doctor appointment you guys because Kamara had her seven year old checkup and her doctor is very very concerned about her vision okay so we're here at the eye doctor um once i leave here you guys my camera's actually about to go this i have literally like a few minutes to talk to you guys so ah, let me be quick um and i do not have my charger with me it's at home so once we leave here you guys um yeah yes i have found an apartment i have found an apartment you guys i have found an apartment for november moving you guys but y'all I had kind of put the whole rental house situation on a back burner because I'm like, okay, you know, I've been looking at a couple of houses. I haven't found anything that I like. Most of them, they look really extremely old and they're overcharging for these old ass houses. And I just didn't find anything that I just really liked it. But you guys, um, I don't know. The Lord just been speaking to me, y'all. The Lord has been speaking to me because I actually settled on this, on this $1,400 apartment, you guys. Two bedroom, two bathroom. Of course, once I pay my water, my lights, um, what else? 
insurance and all that an apartment is gonna be over sixteen hundred dollars you guys so for apartment so you know you guys the lord has been speaking to me over the last over the last week you guys about this house situation and i i had put it on a back burner you guys but i said you know what let me find me let me find me a new realtor um and try to look at a couple of more houses you all so that's what i've been doing like the last past week i found me a realtor she's super cool and you guys she has been sending me some amazing houses um they look really good like really really good you guys and for 1400 you guys some of these houses are three bedroom two bathroom or they are two bath two bedroom two bathroom or they are a three bedroom two bathroom with one half bath some of them are upstairs downstairs some of them are just a flat um so they are some really like i mean there are some decent houses there i mean they don't look too old or anything like that um of course these houses they're not coming like the luxury luxury style they're not coming with garden bathtubs because these houses were built early 2000s and stuff like that so i mean they're not they're not coming like luxury luxury but for 1400 dollars, i mean i'd rather get a house see what i'm saying for something over 1400 dollars, i'd rather get a house i'd rather have an upstairs downstairs i'd rather have a three bedroom instead of a two bedroom see what i'm saying i'd rather have a two bathroom I, you know stuff like that you guys so I don't necessarily care about the luxury luxury you guys I I just really want a house y'all like I need space that's my thing you guys I need space I want to be in my own home like I am so over these freaking apartments you guys so that's what I've been doing like the last you know week you guys we have been looking at houses I have not been bringing you guys with me because I really don't want to show y'all these houses and then I end up getting one and I show it to y'all instead of me waiting until I do to I get the home and then do a house tour. See what I'm saying? Because y'all would have already seen it. See what I'm saying? So that's why I have not brought you guys with me. But you guys, I have looked at a lot of houses. I have a lot of options. So I'm just trying to see you guys what I really want to do. But the Lord is telling me, Quadina, get a house. Get a house. Get a house. You guys, I have been in apartments my whole life except the one time that me and my child father had a rental home together you guys and we didn't even stay in that house we stayed in the house with a good year right there two years we stayed in the house and then we was out but you're like i'm just i'm just over these apartments but i mean like i said um a while ago you guys it push come to shove what sit down it push comes to shove if i have to go with an apartment i'm just gonna go with an apartment but i feel like for fourteen hundred dollars and up Baby, I can get me a house. <laughs> I can be in me a house. Get out of that. You're not getting nothing that's in that bag, so stop it. I can get me... Hey, hey, hey. You already ate, so stop it. <sighs> I can get me a house for that much. See what I'm saying? I, I can. If I'm going to pay $1,500, $1,600, let me be in the house. Okay? Let me be in the house. I could deal with not having a garden tub. I could deal with not having an island. I could deal with not having... The beautiful bright bright lights i can get on amazon about some light bulbs see what i'm saying so like i can't i can deal with not having those things as long as it's a house see what i'm saying so because i was really baby i was about to i was really going okay so y'all cut off on me what i was saying um when i was talking you guys cut off on me so like i was saying was if push comes shut if i got to get to get the apartment i'm gonna get the apartment because it's not available until november so it's still there it's still an option but if she could really get me into one of these houses you guys i'm gonna give me a house like i'm gonna give me a house fuck that garden to a fuck that island like i'm gonna get me a house you guys like i just need the space like i need the room and then some of these houses there are three bedroom i mean for the amount i'm paying an apartment i can go ahead and get a three bedroom house so i'm saying and then like, i can have an office i can make a beauty room like i can do i can do more content with a three bedroom see what i'm saying then mimi have her room then i have my room see what i'm saying and then i'll have an office slash beauty room so i can do more content for you guys see what i'm saying <laughs> so i can get back to doing my house and stuff like that you guys so i mean that will work for me um so i mean y'all that's the goal like i really i really had put this house situation back burning but y'all the lord been speaking to me it just it just ain't been sitting right with me to go ahead with this apartment like 
it's just not y'all i'm really torn in between the two like i don't because the the apartment you guys it comes with a garden tub it comes with the luxury like it looks a luxury you guys but i had to think i have to think why is you guys you know i've been apartments my whole life okay I mean, I, 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 I want a home. I want a home. I need the room. These apartments, you guys, they're making these apartments so small, so tight. It's no freaking room. And you're paying all this money a month. Baby, just give me a house. <laughs> just give me a house, you guys. So that's what me and my realtor are doing right now. I'm so happy that I found her, you guys. Because the first person I had, they just really wasn't trying to work with me like that. You know, they were just really just showing me anything and i didn't like any of those homes but her she's really like putting the footwork in you guys and she's really sending me and showing me some really really nice homes you guys and affordable homes so um you know that's i think that's what i'm gonna go with you know once we you know apply and stuff like that i'm hoping i'm praying i'm trusting i'm believing in god i'm having faith that you know at least because I, I have a whole list you guys of homes and i'm just hoping you know when i do you know go ahead and apply for these homes you know i get them you guys i get them and i can just you know go with the one i really like it's actually it's four of them you guys it's four of them that i really 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 like and you know I just I just have to see you guys that's all I could do but you know I have an option I have the apartment on home so we'll know um I don't really attend on um moving of course into November like the first week of November middle of November because y'all my lease is not up at the apartment complex until the end of November you guys so that's that you guys and like it's just i don't know it's just it's like every time i get ready to renew my lease at these apartments something happened right now you guys my oven it's not even getting hot so i'm saying and it's like dang it's almost time for me to renew a lease over there now my oven tripping it's just it's just, yeah i'm just i'm just ready to go i'm ready to go okay i'm ready to go mimi needs her own room you guys i need space i i'm 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 ready to go you guys um so that's that i have more houses to look at with her today mimi is about to go in here um it's actually 10 12 right now but her appointment is not to 10 30 so once i put you guys down i'm gonna go in there we're gonna handle that then i'm gonna go look at some more houses today you guys then y'all i need to go get mimi a new social security card and i need to get me a new social security card you guys so i'm gonna go do that today because you need to go get a passport okay so y'all cut off on me again my camera's actually overheating on me but like i was saying um we gotta go get some new social security cards you guys because i need to go apply for mimi a passport so she needs uh her social security card and she actually needs a new one you guys i need new ones mine are trouble so uh i'm gonna go get both of us some new ones today you guys so once those come in the mail and i'm actually trying to do that before i move so once those come in the mail you guys i'm gonna take it i'm gonna go get mimi a passport apply for her passport pay for it that way by march that bad boy is here because we about to go okay we're about to go you guys so we're about to we're gonna be going on vacation so yeah i need her passport like asap and right now it's actually september so it's going to probably take like a week for her social security card to come in. So, yeah, she will have her passport because I'm going to go ahead and pay for it and stuff this month. So, by March, she will have her passport. But the thing is, oh, I'm not going to be able to get it mailed. I'm going to have to go mail it to a family member house. I'm going to have to mail it to a family member house because... I will be gone by the time it comes to the mail. So I can't get it. I can't get it shipped to my apartment, you guys, because I'll be gone. But yeah, so I'm gonna do that because I need that bad boy to come in ASAP because I don't want to book any tickets anywhere until I have baby girl passport. Okay. So that's that. So that's pretty much what's on the agenda today. Um probably will not pick I know for shit show. I'm not gonna pick you guys when I am with my realtor because we're gonna be looking at houses and I don't want to show you guys the houses because if I choose one and i already showed it to y'all why i'm touring it it's pointless to do a new house tour with you guys so stop, stop. not gonna do that so that's that um 
but yeah y'all that's pretty much what's on the agenda today um when i get home you guys i want hey little girl stop it when i get home you guys i want to start packing i know i told y'all the other day i was gonna be packing up them clothes and stuff in my closet but i ain't did it yet so once i get home today I need to be doing that you guys that is what's on the agenda but you guys let me go ahead and put you down because it's time to go inside and this girl gotta get her eyes checked so yeah. I'll just pick you guys up okay bye stop it <laughs> so I'll pick you guys up Layla bye bye <laughs> bye y'all bye Hey y'all, welcome back to the vlog. So you guys now, um, it's kind of later on in the day. Um, I finished looking at houses, you guys. So now it's all about <laughs> basically just applying and seeing if these homes will, you know, still be available um, for the time frame I need for moving, which will be November, you guys. But right now I'm at the park, you guys, because I came to bring Mimi. Let me show y'all her. Yay, Mimi. <laughs> so, yeah, y'all. So, the houses that I did see today, you guys, are beautiful, y'all. I like them. I like them a whole lot. But I really got my eyes on the upstairs, downstairs ones instead of, like, the flat ones. Um, so, you know, I can get my money to work, you guys. Um, so, yeah, so that's that, y'all. It is extremely extremely hot out here but i wanted to, i wanted to bring her out here so that she can play you guys so that's that hey so yeah so i really really like the houses you guys but i mean me and my realtor we're gonna continue looking at homes because you guys um some of these homes might not still be available for november the ones that we looked at so um you know each week <laughs> we're gonna continue looking at more and more homes you guys so that i can find the one that's best for me you guys okay but i did see a couple of them today that i just love but i mean we'll have to see you guys we'll just we'll just have to see so that's how this is going but like i said if push come to shove if i have to do the apartment i'm gonna do the apartment <laughs> And that's gonna be that you guys so that's what it is you guys so i'm gonna stay out here for a little bit and let her play 15 more minutes you guys and then um we're gonna go ahead and head to the social security office like i explained to you guys earlier because i need to get her stuff so that i can go ahead and apply for her passport y'all i need i need to apply for her passport like now so um I'm gonna do that you guys and then I'm gonna go ahead and head back home and I'll probably pick you guys back up once I am home but yeah I just want to pick y'all up and let y'all know how the day was going everything went well oh you guys so when we went to her eye doctor appointment y'all Kamara has a she has a a disease called it's it's so hard to pronounce you guys but he did write it down on my paperwork so um once i get that paperwork i will explain to you guys what it is the name of it but basically she has to wear glasses um permanently like every day all day she has to wear glasses and this disease is pretty permanent you guys so she will be actually wearing glasses like you know pretty much the rest of her life until well i guess until her eyes really get better but this this disease is pretty much permanent you guys um so the way he explained it to me was she uh, her prescription that will be in her glasses or the kind of glasses that you see kids wearing that are pretty thick and it make their eyes look big you guys 
that's the kind that she will have the prescription um it's a very strong prescription because my baby cannot see you guys she cannot see um when he tested her he actually tested her three times you guys and it's pretty bad it's, it's very very bad um and he says that you know kids can be born with it it can be um you know due to family history stuff like that you guys um so it's nothing you can really control but she does have this um i cannot pronounce the name of it you guys so when i do get my paperwork i will tell you guys the name of it but she pretty much have to wear glasses like she has to wear glasses um she has to wear glasses you guys it's permanent she has to wear glasses so that's that so i do need to have to go and get her some glasses her um her insurance you guys I could have got glasses there. They do, they do offer them. They do sell them. But her insurance, her insurance is not paying for her glasses, which I don't understand. That it paid for the visit, but it's not paying for her glasses. Okay, it's only paying seventeen dollars for her glasses. So I'm not understanding that. So I'm gonna try a different. Uh, I'm gonna try. I'm gonna try a couple of different other places and see if the insurance you know will pay for her glasses and everything instead of just going with um that doctor office um i'm gonna try and you know see or whatever but um yeah y'all so now my baby has to wear glasses but i mean it is you know it is what it is you know it's life it you know it is what it is i'm just more concerned of her being bullied i don't want her being bullied just because she you know has to wear these glasses and from what he said from what he said that the prescription is the one the glasses that's pretty thick that you might see some kids when it's pretty thick and it make their eyes look big and stuff that's what i'm thinking that's what he says so i'm thinking that's how they're gonna look but um i don't i want i really won't know until i get her glasses back you guys you done what's wrong it's hot it is it's very hot out here we'll go play for like five more minutes go play for like five more minutes and then we'll go because i'm talking to the besties right now <laughs> drinking that soda you need water girl go play baby i got it go play go play so yeah so yeah y'all so um that's that's pretty much my concern i don't want my baby to be bullied but it's life it's life you guys um so it's just gonna be a adjustment um with her with these glasses and stuff i know she's not gonna want to wear them she's gonna think she looks crazy and stuff like that but he did say she needs to wear them she also has to go see a specialist um about her eyes as well so um once a year she will go back to this doctor she'll go back to him and then she will now see a specialist as well you guys um about her eyes and she also i don't believe i told you guys but she also has to go see a a high risk specialist about her about the way she's growing you guys because her doctor is also concerned about how she's growing um how she's forming out quickly um what i mean is like her chest area stuff like that you guys she's um she's growing she's growing pretty pretty fastly even her height and stuff so um she has to go and see a high risk specialist as well um that's also called something that the neurologist or something like that it's called i don't want to pronounce the wrong wording for that but it's something i have it on my paperwork you guys so that's that you guys she had to go and see two specialists now um but you know i mean it's you know it, it just is what it is you guys i can't sit up and cry about it i can't be upset i can't be mad about it it just is what it is but i'm definitely gonna get the best care that i can get for my child okay um so that's that so i just want to give you guys a rundown of what's been going on um i know y'all i'll be picking y'all up putting y'all down i'll be y'all i really be ripping and running trying to take care of stuff do things and everything like that but while i'm sitting here i just kind of want to give you guys a rundown what's actually been going on and yeah y'all that's that my earring done to be i might ill. so y'all that's that's that um i probably won't pick out back up until i get home 
Because I got to go do a couple of more things today, you guys. But yeah, y'all. I'm going to put y'all down because my phone is actually overheating. Because this sun is beaming. You done? Huh? You ready to go? No? Get on the slide. Let me see you slide down the slide. Come on. Get on there. All right, y'all. Bye. Bye.